and oh. Seeing all the people with their sun tents walking and talking and holding hands while strolling down the avenue in Venice, stopping with some friends to chat a while. Strolling down the avenue in Venice, you can always share a smile. Hi, I'm V. Gary Cooley, and today we're filming V on Venice at the Pelican Point Golf and Country Club, where you are going to be so lucky today because you will be receiving some instruction on how to improve your golf swing from one of the best pros in our area, Wahoo Jacobs. And here he is. Come on over, Wahoo. How are you, Vic? I'm fine. And you know, I want to ask this question, you know. Um, is this what you say when one hits the tremendous drive? You say, Wahoo! Is that what we say? <laughs> Quite a few folks have. <laughs> <laughs> is that where you got your name? No, they don't let you off the reservation. That's a funny name. <laughs> oh, well, you know what? I've seen your commercial, and just talking with you as I have been, your voice is so beautiful and comforting and soothing. I would take lessons from any lessons from you <laughs> is that going a little too far not at all not at all <laughs> okay so what we call wahoo's particular technique is the effortless golf swing do you want to explain it just briefly before we start to demonstrate it sure i'd be happy to the uh, effortless golf concept i developed it about four years ago and it's really designed for people to learn to swing a golf club without having to put a lot of work into it a lot of effort and find themselves walking away frustrated from trying so hard. Uh, I've developed techniques that help people who are beginners, intermediate, advanced players, professional players, to be able to help them do better at what they're wanting to do better at by starting with their mind first and working on their physical characteristics second. And you know, that's what Larry always says. It's a mind game, you know. You have to have it in your mind. You're going to win. and So that's that's very important and I know you were telling me too also that you develop certain techniques to help one overcome a physical problem disability whatever no, it's very true uh, the folks that I work with um, people who are blind um, people who are amputees folks that I've worked with in the past uh, we have a fellow we'll be working with today who has rheumatoid arthritis and gout and it's very debilitating, uh, debil debilitating uh -huh. okay, uh, for most folks, but Jimmy does very, very good at it. I have another lady with us today who suffers from carpal tunnel syndrome. And over the last six months, we've shown her how to swing with one arm for where she can play golf with her husband. Um, it's been fun. Uh, a lot of the folks I've worked with over the years, last few years anyway, uh, a good many of them suffer from surgeries that they've had, such as... Now, let's see. You have hip uh, replacement uh -huh. surgeries, rotator knees, cuff surgeries, knees. knee surgeries, that mm -hmm. type of thing. Most of these folks start to go back to the game and not realize that they're hurting themselves more by trying to be overly protective. And I show them techniques so that they're not hurting themselves, but actually performing better and not worrying about the issues that they had fixed. Well, that's, that's terrific. Mm -hmm. And Wahoo teaches lessons here at Pelican Point. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll put up the number on the screen and then anyone who's listening who wants some extra special instructions, this is the fella to call. <laughs> Gee, see, I didn't realize that you specialized like that. I really do. Uh, when I took this game up uh, not all that long ago, you know, there were a lot of things that people did that caused them frustration. And that was something that really kind of interested me. All my life I've taught something. And this really kind of fell into place. It was one of those, you know, you couldn't have called it any better if it just fell in your slap. And it did. But the techniques that I've been able to develop have helped a great many people. Um, works well with juniors. we got a junior with us today. Uh, little Robert working with him for the uh, last couple of years. And he's got a fine golf swing with him. You know, he lives in Atlanta, but he comes down, visits, and, you know, hey, Wahoo, can I get a lesson? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. You so betcha. you're watching his progress then, watching aren't you? Progress. Okay, well, this is what we want to do. We want some action here, right? And Bring we're going on. to start off with Robert because you're never too young. How old is he, do you know? Let's see. I'm not. Eight? 
Okay, come on, Robert. Robert is eight years old. I didn't know that. Oh, okay, Rob. You're eight, eight years old, huh? Here's this darling little boy. Tell us your name now. Robert. Robert Shaw. Okay, and do you like this game of golf and Wahoo here? Yes. Oh, you can go be a little more elaborate than that. How much do you like him? Very much. <laughs> That's better. <laughs> okay, so you're going to show us. I'm getting out of the picture now, so it's up to you and Wahoo. You go and show us what you can do. How far can you hit that ball out there? About 125 yards. Holy Toledo, Larry. Does that beat me? I think so. Oh, no. Okay, go to it, kids. Okay. Come on, Robert. Let's show them what you can do, buddy. We'll set ourselves up. Let's grab a couple of golf balls. Now, Robert and I had a playing lesson last night, and I was really impressed with his progress on the golf course. I haven't had an opportunity to in the past, and we had a real good time with it. Let's see your balls here, partner. Thank you. What I'd like to do is get Robert out this way, and we're going to set you up here. And if you get a chance, let's grab that ball behind you, Robert. There we go. What I'd like to see more than anything is how he's developed a positive attitude while he's trying to swing the golf club and not being overly concerned about hitting the golf ball. He does a fine job at following through. And uh, young fellows develop some awesome yardage. Let's take a look at you, partner. That's right down the middle without any warm up. Got himself. About a, about a buck and a quarter, <laughs> you reckon? Okay. Now, if you notice, Robert's developed a very good tempo, which is speed, and he's taking a very, very calm swing. And with his muscles relaxed, he's able to release the golf club through the ball, which gives him good distance and control. Yeehaw. Got himself a little fade, but it's in play. And that's the key to this game. Most folks get overly concerned about having to hit the center. You've got a gracious fairway. A lot of times we're doing well just to hit the fairway. Be happy with that. Don't be so tough on yourself. I know he's in the fairway right there. He's got a great shot at the second one. Thanks for hitting with me, buddy. You're welcome. All right, pal. Thanks for coming down. Okay. Well, we enjoyed Robert taking his swings. The youngster's going to do real well for eight years of age. He does a beautiful job. Next up, we have Judy Robb with us. Judy suffers from nerve damage uh, due to carpal tunnel syndrome, so she really only has use of her left arm to be able to swing a golf club. And we've been working with Judy for the last several months, and I'm really proud of her and really impressed because she's done well. The interest was to play golf with her husband, and I think she'll do real well with it. Might even take his money once in a while, right? <laughs> this is Judy. Very, very proud of her. And uh, we're going to have Judy take a few swings with uh, her club. If you notice, the golf club she's using is not standard length because of the nerve condition and the way she's able to swing the golf club we shortened it up for her and she's been doing real, real well we'll have Judy take a few swings have some fun there my dear that's the whole point of this oh my that's my girl wow. that's my girl so you can do it with one hand, can with one hand. <laughs> if you have the right attitude and Judy's got it Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Get a couple of holes going here, and she'll really start taking some cash from you. She has a very, very good golf swing for the time that she's been able to put into it. Ooh. That's okay. <laughs> Those happen to the best of us with two arms. It's broken. That's okay. That'll work just fine. We did break out. I think we got another good swing in you. One more. Why not? You have a big. That's all that I've got. Oh, I have it in my pocket. Do you? All right, we're in. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. The whole thing about this effortless golf concept is that it's usable by anybody with any kind of physical condition who would like to do something. It doesn't mean that you'll have a Tiger Woods golf game, but you will have a golf swing that'll work for you. All right, 
we're not putting people on tour, we're putting people where they're having fun with their families, their husbands and wives, that type of thing. Let her rip, my dear. <laughs> Judy, I appreciate you coming out. I enjoyed it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Do you have a physical ailment or are recovering from a sports-induced surgery that you think will limit your golf performance? Effortless Golf is a concept that taps into your inner self and brings out the golfer you can be. Learn how you can develop an effortless golf swing that is tailored for you. Contact Wahoo Jacobs, the teaching professional who developed the Effortless Golf concept the effortless golf concept works for any skill level. Let me tap your golf potential. Stop on in to the Kingfish Cafe where our ever-changing menu promises new and exciting dishes every day. Our wide variety of mouth-watering sandwiches and fresh seafood are sure to please the whole family. Enjoy a taste of Old Key West right here in Venice. Kingfish Cafe, located at the Veranda Inn, 625 South Tamiami Trail, Venice. Center for Sight is proud to present our unique series of free informational seminars featuring live surgery, from painless cataract surgery and LASIK laser vision correction to advanced facial cosmetic procedures, skin care, and natural hair transplantation. These are not just seminars, but experiences. For information and dates, visit our website at centerforsight.net or call 488-2020. Center for Sight, your clear choice, whatever your needs. The new look of the Venice Gondolier Sun is so great and the type is so large, I don't even have to use my reading glasses. And the new local news section is great. Jan, the business, health, and history columns are terrific additions, really. And I still love that let them have it column. This TV book is the best I've ever seen. I have a great opportunity for you. You can get the Venice Gondolier Sun free trial for two weeks by calling 207-1300 today. When it comes to southwestern cuisine, there's only one place to go, Cactus on the Grill. Whether you're in the mood for one of our delicious steaks, feel like sinking your teeth into the best pork chops around, or just looking to enjoy a drink at our full bar, Cactus on the Grill is the place to be. We're family owned, and after 16 years in Venice, we know how to treat you right. For the best in steaks, drinks, friends, family, and fun, look no further than the heart of Venice. Cactus on the Grill. Come check out our new location and see what everyone's talking about. 997 US 41 Bypass South. We've moved over here to the pitching area. Um, we have Jimmy Cammons with us. Uh, Jimmy is a, an individual who, about in your 60s, Jim? Yes, no, right around there. Around there? Okay. Jimmy suffers from rheumatoid arthritis, and it's a very debilitating situation if anybody's ever experienced or knows somebody that has. And along with that, Jimmy found out he had a little gout going on, so he's got a condition that's uh, going to challenge him as life goes on. However, Jim's not going to give up on life, and he's def taken up golf to uh, <clears throat> have a little fun with it. He's played quite a while, but as the arthritis gets bad, Jimmy and I work together to try to help his game out. And with folks who suffer from limitations as far as movement, we have to find different ways for them to be able to accomplish the same things that they had before. It may not look as pretty as they once had, but when they're taking your money on the golf course, which is a pretty good thing. Let's take a look at Jimmy pitching over here. How you doing, Jim? Good way today, Wallace. Good to see you, buddy. You going to hit some chips for us, pitches? Well, we're going to do our best. Okay. So if I can remember what you taught me. You bet. Now, if you watch Jim, it's not necessarily the most standard type of setup, but it's what allows him to have freedom of movement to swing the golf club. There we go. And Jimmy's kind of snugging him up there. Notice he has no issues following through with the golf club, even on these shots. It may not look like a normal or what people would consider the average setup, but he's doing it in a way that allows him to swing. There we go. Nice, high, soft little pitch and look, almost hold it out. 